The late Prime Minister, Mr. Lee Kuan Yew, is known for his impact and powerful speeches. His speeches maintained Singaporeans' confidence in him as a leader and set the tone for Singapore's policies and the direction in the decades. Lee was not only a great leader, but also a powerful and all-rounded speaker. So, what does it take for my child to truly become an all-rounder speaker? In the month of December, we will be taking you through the topics facial expressions and healing speech, being a personal trainer and the etiquettes of being a great speaker. Words are active and live. They contain tremendous power. Delivering an uplifting and inspiring speech is easy, but a speech that helps to remove the sadness and hurt of audience is challenging. This could be achieved through empathy, the ability to understand Place yourself in their position and share the feeling of another person can help to comfort them because they will realize that they are not alone. As a speaker, the movements of your eyes, mouth and facial muscles can build a connection with your audience too. Facial expression, however, could be a double-edged sword. A connection can be built with sincerity and credibility or it could possibly undermine your every word as you speak. As the year-end approaches, Level 2 students will be given an opportunity to emulate their coaches and in turn, pass on their knowledge and skills to Level 1 students. Teaching others will inculcate a sense of autonomy and aptitude for managerial responsibility, which will aid them in their future endeavours as the students venture into the working world. Now, are you ready to embark on the journey to become an all-rounder speaker?